Jordan to fill up out of the back of the diamond. But if one wants to go back to how it all started, I think one needs to go back to a fight in a fair at Mount Norris in 1784, um, there was all sorts of entertainment and, uh, and obviously gambling as well. So these two Presbyterian farmers had, had a fight uh, and uh, when one of the seconds intervened, a Catholic intervened, uh, one, the defeated Presbyterian uh, blamed uh, the, the Roman Catholic for interfering. And as a result of that, um, these gangs, it was the Bunkers Hill Defender Group, and the Defender Organisation developed out of that. And of course, they, their activities became widespread, and then they were opposed by the Break of Day, or People Day boys who carried out these dawn raids on Catholic homes. So that was all, uh, all of this was going on as a prelude, and it built up to the, the formation of, of the Orange Order, uh, subsequent to the Battle of the Diamond. In, in the Armagh context, um, we know that there's a group um, at Dian, uh, quite near uh, Loch Gaul, just across in, in Tyrone, and another location called Derry Scallop, which is another rural um, townland. And they are known as the Orange Boys or the Orange Club of Dian and of Derry Scallop. Whenever the, the confrontation that's known as the Battle of the Diamond occurs, uh, after that, a decision is taken to form a, a fraternal organisation that will, will act as defenders of, of the Protestants in the area. So we know that um, there were groups existing before 1795 calling themselves um, the Orange Club or Orange Clubs. Where this house comes in, the House at the Crossroads was burned. What had happened that morning and the need to form themselves into an organisation to protect themselves from like attack and to uphold the reformed faith. And they came into Dan with their own house to have that discussion. So that room is where the decision was made to actually form the Orange Order and they decided that Sloan's and Loch Gaul would be the better place to have all other discussions and where warrants would be issues, issued and lodges formed. It's like a shrine to the orange men. They look on this as their birthplace. 